that about all you got left you're going to do? Alright, what it tastes like, let's see if you can do these, they get their head down. Um, you know, they'll get them up here and they're going to sit up here and they can get these little races where they don't get the guy. You know, one of my favorite cigarette things to do is to do this thing right here, scroll down and then come up. Now on the bottom, now I got leverage. Now I'm going to show you a little secret too on these. To the ear, I'm going to drag the knuckle across the ear, and I'm going to drag the knuckle across the jaw, the jawline too, not just the ear. But keep, he keeps his head strong so I can't turn him. I, I got it. Anytime I do any kind of neck crank or headlock, I got to get his head turned. I cannot get his head. Keep, keep it up. I can't get his head turned. He's not letting me. Watch this. He turns it there. Now when I frame up, I grab behind the arm, and right here, right. Let me show you something. Right here, a lot of people think it's in the arms. It's not. It's, it's really in the chest. But how I'd really like to do this in real life is I'd like to hook that leg and, and fall forward. I can't. So I don't want to, you know, hurt him training here. So I'll I'll use a thumb grip a lot of times with these to get more leverage. But as I drop my chest, I turn that wrist up and I turn it in. Sorry, Brett. So again, I'm dragging across. So we're rest, even over on the ground, we're wrestling. I'm trying to turn his head, I'm peeling that head. That's all. The deeper on the arm, the better. Yeah. So, well, no, not necessarily. I mean, it's just uh, it's it's wherever your leverage is. So, like, if I'm right here and here, the more I'm over the top of the head, the better. Yeah. So the chest is on that head. Right here, you don't get a lot of leverage. So what I'll do is I'll sprawl back and I'll just and I'll, and I'll drive that in. Now, if I turn him. I'll circle in, hook the leg, headlock him. That's how I headlock. And that's just one position, right? And I might come in and... But anytime I headlock, I gotta get the head turned. If he was down, I need back. Is that your bad arm? Sorry. Yeah. So if he was down, let's just say, and I get his head right here, and I want to headlock him, it's not how far I bend in here, it isn't. Right here is how much I can, what can I do to get his head turned. So, uh, in this situation, I get his head like so, and I get it, I get it up and I get it turned, and keep my weight just up, keep my head off, right there on that floating rib, you feel that? And I just crank it out. A lot of times, you know, I'm on, Again, like if I'm in a head and arm scenario right here, you know, how am I going? How am I going to get this headlock to really count? So if I'm in here and here, I'm trying to do all these different things. I'm bending them up. That's not working. None of this is working. And he's staying pretty pretty strong. Right here, I use my shoulder. And we face up. Just bend it. I use my shoulder and I rotate his chin down so I get that hooked under. I'm just right here. It's almost like a football grip. Mm -hmm. I'm in here. I'm in tight. Yeah, bread, I'm gonna break your neck. Don't be carrying that thing like a loaf of bread. <laughs> See? You okay? Yeah. So when I'm in here, like I said, you know, he, he's like, well, don't keep your head strong if I can get it. So he doesn't want to let me get it. So I just do. I just gonna just do something right here on the chin, and I can cross face and do this stuff too, right? But like if I was picking up this way, this way right here, I'm not gonna get it probably that way. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna turn the head that way. If it was so, I want to get on that chin. I'm gonna get his chin turned. You kind of like you're just wringing the neck. <laughs> And my weight down on it. I don't do these grips. I like to get down on it above my weight and I'm turning that chin and then I'm pulling it in. Sorry. So like if I got this arm, I'm not I'm not I'm not going okay. I'm just gonna scissor you. I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna crank on your shoulder or neck, but that way. But see how my chest turns your head? Yeah. Put it on your chin. And I stuck it. 
Okay? Yeah. Of course, that didn't work. I come in here just to just strike neck, oh. which are harder to hit. But get the head turn on all headlocks. Even if I was doing some maneuver like this, where I basically I like a figure four and rotate them up. Okay? Oh. Sorry, Brett. <laughs> So when I get these, don't just lift the head up, get that chin turned. And the more you get it turned, see where that is? I can lean over the, don't get, try to roll me, go to roll me. See, you're not going to go to roll me. I'm going to stop. That's going to look like an owl both ways. <laughs> yeah, you just want to roll his neck. He's got to, cause, I'll show you this real quick, stand up. Then you know this, this little trick, but just in case you forgot. Um, I'm going to pull his head down, pull your head up. Ah, okay. It's just like on the full Nelsons. Yeah, forward time. If I'm right here and I'm pushing forward, put your hands on your forehead. I'm not going to get him. If I go in deep and hook over near the ear and hook on the side, pull him to me. I can pull Nelson all day that way. So the same thing with the headlocks. He's got, right this way, he's got strength, right? See if I bend over, let me just pull your head down. So, but now get it strong, okay? No, 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 don't lift up. Get your neck strong though. Don't lift up, don't lift up. Just be ready for this. So he's, his neck's strong, you know? He's like, let me turn his head. Watch this. No, don't let me pull your head down. All right, now relax. Now I'm gonna turn it, now get your head strong again. Don't let me pull it down. He doesn't have any power, it takes away his, what are those, your traps? So I'm taking away this. So anytime I face lock, anytime I headlock in general, even if we're wrestling right here and I hook his chin, I like to get a cut a little bit of a crank just to take away the power. So that's just on my chest, and this is just rolling up. I'm just stepping in, just like so. Okay, and the same thing when I'm down, I have to have the head looking away to create a net lock. If he drop on your back one more time, real quick. I promise I'm not going to kill you. If I'm just right here and here and I pull it back, nothing. Now you can, you might remember these, where we'll hook in and <laughs> drive the elbow into the into the floating yeah. rib yeah. or into the chest. Or I'll drive into the side with the knuckles. Right? Those are some just nasty carny yeah. tricks right there. Now I lied, I hurt you, I'm sorry. <laughs> but <laughs> I didn't really use anything about it. See, so, but on the headlock, not, not any kind of ripping or any of that good stuff right now. Getting the head turned. Just getting the head turned. Here's a big difference. Boy, he's tapping. I ain't been headlocked in it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> That's it. You're done. Not Charlie. Um, what time you wake up in the morning?